are doing party crashes <laughs> all right so let's get on to this beat okay so um we are finally finding the real reason why um shitty uh la whatever that man named air colder why he did nipsey the way he did okay they said it was not nothing to do with no conspiracy but it had everything to do with jealousy honey okay and did y'all know he took pictures with this man before look at this picture hold on bam look at this they say that's um nipsey right there right and you see they circle nipsey you know yeah i don't like to say the k-word that much but you get what i'm saying Ain't that so sad to be the same ones as close to you, friends with you. Anyway, they said um, before uh, Eric did what he did, he shook hands with Nipsey, honey. So let's play and let's get to the bottom of this, okay? The reason why it's over jealousy, okay? They say he was a rapper and he was jealous of Nipsey. He was uh, uh, was uh, doing positive things in the community, uh, trying to save lives and, and, and for one of the people that he was trying to save to come back and kill him, it was nothing but jealousy and envy. So, it's a sad situation. The world is going to miss Nipsey. Not just this neighborhood, but all around the world. Everybody talking I've known him since about 2003 when he was a youngster, since he was probably about 18, 19 years old. When I came home from prison, uh, he was out here selling his CD, so we sold CDs together. Uh, we had dreams of uh, doing it big. And, uh, he did it big, and uh, he, he left his niche on earth. When we were in the business. We used to use the parking lot as our office before we even had an office in, in the building. So every day we would show up like we were at the office. So uh, I've been there from day one. Uh, uh, we started off selling CDs in the trunk of the car 16 years ago. Uh, Nipsey was... Uh, and we just purchased the building, just bought the whole building. So it's been 16 years in the making. Me and Nipsey was talking, and uh, the dude that shot him, he came and shook our hands. Said he was a rapper and all this old bullshit. Uh, shook our hands. The dude went and got his burger. He left. When he left, I went and took my food in. As soon as I took my food inside the building, uh, the dude came back around the building busting. So I might have left Nipsey's side maybe three seconds. I left him maybe approximately about three seconds that I had left Nipsey and, and, and the dude came and shot him. We know who he is. There's no, it's no mystery. Uh, there's no mystery. We know who he is. Like I said, it was, uh, it's all hate and envy. That's all it was. It was jealousy, hate, and envy. Uh, Nipsey didn't deserve to die like that. Uh, 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 what seems to be a less talented rapper, uh, you know, uh, had envy and hate in his eyes. That's what it was all about. It was, it was nothing else. It was no motive. It was no beef. It was nothing. It was nothing but envy, hate. And we well, y'all heard it here. It was nothing but envy and hate. Another thing, uh, let's give congratulations. So the Congress member, Bass, honey, she's going to make sure that Nipsey Hussle stays in our history forever, okay? He will be a part of United States history forever, all right? Thanks to Miss Bass, you guys can read it here. So um, everybody's been affected to this, you know, from ATL, Douglas, Detroit. Everybody is um, mourning this week about Nipsey. We definitely uh, took an L with this. Comment, let us know what you guys think about all this, and I will see you guys sooner than later. Bye.